Hi guys, it's Andre. So, in today's video, I'm gonna be doing uh, something that came up to me like yesterday or two days ago, I don't remember, but anyway. I was just so bored and I wanted to wear makeup and I just did like a quick makeup look, pretty much did nothing. And I was like, I should film this for YouTube. So first I'm gonna start with my favorite foundation <laughs> that I have been wearing non-stop the Kat Von D Lucky foundation it was my previous um, video if you haven't watched it watch it it'll probably be linked at the end of this video or down below or you can just subscribe and you'll be watching all my future videos but anyway oh in this video I'm also going to be showing you uh, some tricks that you can use the same makeup product but for a lot of uses anyway I'm gonna get into it because if I start talking I will never shut up so I'm probably gonna use more than I would use normally because I'm gonna use the foundation as concealer too because again, I'm too lazy to do all the steps that I do all the time. Oh, now it's time to color correct and if you thought that I wasn't going to color correct because this is a lazy makeup tutorial you were very wrong because I color correct always so I'm gonna use my finger ain't nobody got time for other stuff now I'm gonna use some more of my foundation as concealer which I did on my um, last video which was pretty much a review first impression of the of this foundation and yeah Okay, so now I'm gonna use my AOA Perfect Setting Powder and I'm gonna set my whole face with this Yay! I'm gonna be using my AOA Sculpting Brow Gel in the shade Medium Brown and this has a spoolie and I'm gonna brush my eyebrows down as I always do and I'm gonna make little brown, little, what? Little eyebrow hairs, pretty much just drawing in lines. Okay, so I'm done. I mean, I'm almost done with the brows. I'm just gonna use a setting gel. Just set them in place. So I'm gonna move on to the face and I'm gonna be using like a standard blush brush. And this is the Victoria Silk completely busted and very, very cheap product that I have that I rarely use pretty much for Occasions like this when I'm really bored to do my makeup and I just want something that doesn't have much intense color and I know it's not gonna like Do a stamp on my face. So yeah, this is a blush and a bronzer duo and they're both Whoa, and they're both shimmery 
and I love that it's a little bit shimmery, the bronzer. I, I never use blush, but I love the fact that it's shimmery because it means it's gonna look a bit more natural in my opinion. <laughs> because it'll look like you've been sun-kissed and like you know you've been tanning a lot in the sun and just you know she'd like that but I the sun doesn't know who I am seriously and I don't know who he is because I rarely get out of my house I mean I listen I do get out of my house but it's usually at night and I rarely go to the beach. I went to the beach like a few days ago after, I don't know, a year or two years of not going to the beach, so. And I did get a little bit tanned, which I hate because I don't like getting tanned. I don't like me, the version of, the tanned version of Andri. I just don't like that bitch, you know? And I currently don't like myself. <laughs> no, I'm kidding, but um, am I the only one who doesn't like to get tanned? Like seriously, I think I look like shit when I'm tanned. I hear everyone like, oh my god, like you need to go to the beach, you know, and like get a bit tan, tanned, what? Um, like get a little bit of color on you. Well, maybe I like being a pale ass, okay? Which I do. Oh, let me bronze up my nose a little bit. Now, I'm gonna use the same old Jessup tapered blending brush that I use all the time for my highlight. Because it's my favorite brush for highlighting. And I'm gonna get my MAC Soft and Gentle Highlighter, which is a rose gold highlighter. And I think it looks really good in general. But I think on my lazy days lazy makeup days I just I love using it because it's like it's not as intense as my silver highlighters okay now I'm gonna go back to the bronzer and I'm gonna use my uh, Jessup small tapered blending brush and I'm gonna grab the good old bronzer and use it as eyeshadow Just so I don't have a completely flat eye. A little bit on my lower lash line too. So yeah, I'm gonna be using my Kybella uh, Voluminator Spider Mascara. Seriously, I still don't know what the name of this mascara is. Maybe it has a lot of things, I don't know. Uh, the only thing that we have left is lipstick. I'm gonna be using my 17 lipstick in the number... Oh, what am I doing? In the number 8. You can't apply it real fast. Okay. And this is literally the whole makeup look. Like, I'm done. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was just like an idea that popped in my head. I hope you liked it. Click the red button down below. Give this video a like and follow me on my social media it's all linked in the description below and i will see you in my next video very soon goodbye